We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to the Freak Show, where our one rule is long fights are our specialty. At least last episode it was. We'll see how it goes this time around. I'm your host, Bumpy Big Squiggums. Still haven't slept, but we're playing a bit more of a quest that became legend. And you know we're we're doing we're doing all right. We're having a good time. I was gonna actually train her, uh, our our girl here, in heavy armor, but she can only learn one level in it, and the people here only teach level two. So I couldn't train it, and that's fine because we're just probably gonna go with light. But yeah, it's a thing. Right, if I want to buy and sell, I should be using her. I forgot about that. Well, that's okay. Well, we did okay in our initial battle with the U. There is bound to be more. Oh, I also learned that I was unable to drop down those holes, even though it looked like I, I should be, or that I was going to be able to. This is super dark. Sorry, uh, yeah. Yep. Cool. I don't think anything there was, like, impressive. So, like, right now, thankfully, most of what we're doing, we're not getting, like, ambushes from behind and things of that nature coming up on us. Because you know that stuff's going to start happening at some point, and it's going to not be fun. But it hasn't happened to you. Oh my god, that's a very high amount. Uh-huh. What resistance? Yep, I'll throw that on you. 15 armor class? It's fine. So you got 12, one attack power. I mean, that's... 34. That might even be higher than what I'm using. It is. That's an absurdly large amount of armor. Might set it off to the side. Is it worth losing the one attack power? And the three poison resist? I I don't know right now. I, I'd say right now it doesn't feel like it would be. But who knows? Could be. All right, we know there's at least one dude there, and I believe he's within range of her to fire on his booty. Is it really just the three of them? Like, they're giving me some layups, you know? There's some easy shots here, wow. Oh, I thought those were big boys. Oh, there are some big boys in the back, okay. Hey, another level up. You know, I think I'm just gonna... Uh, I can't do it right now. So I'm like, I think I'll just do this now. I don't really see why I wouldn't. Can you reach with your spell? Nope. That's fair. Okay, that hit. That's good. Uh, yeah, I'll shoot this guy. I know I could have backed up a little bit more to get a little more out of our range, but... Eh. I want them to get at least a little bit closer so I can start putting, like, some big hurting on them and whatnot. Yeah, then we throw the fireball out. Yeah, and then we back up now. Big attack there. Let him roll out on us. He didn't quite make it. Nobody really did, which is fine. He's real close to death. Eh, I was hoping to hit them in the back. It didn't. That's okay. 
Yeah, he's pretty he's pretty uh unhappy with how life is going for him. I will taunt. We'll get a little bit closer. Taking this full down. Big shot. Step it up. Can't quite reach. It's okay. Come on, swing on me, buddy. Bring it on. We ready. And there it is. All right. Very, very nice. Unfortunately, old, old man McSquiggum's a little bit on the slow side to leveling up, but that's okay. Old man McSquiggum's. Uh, yeah, I think we're going to go Wisdom 15. Yeah, I think that's what I kind of opted into. What's the special things about Dexterity? Minimum of 30 Dex. For every one point, plus one armor class. And armor class is where? There it is, right there. Wait, so he's got 119 armor class? What do you have? 168. 55 and 82. You should be getting a pretty decent amount of armor and you're getting closer to 30 dexterity where you will also be having that. How close are you to leveling? Oh, you're pretty darn close. Just a few hundred away. So like one more single battle like this and you'll be good. All right, cool. All right. Oops. Uh, yeah. All right. Things are going okay so far. Let's do a quick save just in case we get obliterated. Oh, there's a there's a fair few down there. At least four. Almost guaranteed there's more than four though. All right. Sixty-two. So at this stage, you're within range of fire. Uh, oh, sorry, the uh, frostbolt. What does fireballs range? It's by fifty. All right. Start you with a little frost shot. Okay, nothing's behind me. Seems pretty straightforward. Let them close with us. Eh, alright. That's fair. It hit one of the dudes in the back there. One of the, the double axers, because those guys are pretty nasty, actually. Not not a not a big fan of those boys. Alright, that guy is on death's door. Guy's pretty almost dead as well. All right, this should go very well. Yeah, our, 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 our main man's me. I leveled up. Cool. All right, big hit to you. Baby hit to you. You are uh, definitely on your way out, sir. I'll see you to uh, that way out. This will hit him. It did not. He was able to dodge that. 
which is fantastic. I'll double swing on you. Oh, I want to see how much she does. Not a lot, still baby damage, but at least she's hitting for five. And then the 31 mixed damage for a total of 36 points. I mean, that's not bad for the cleric. I mean, you know. It's pretty decent, I dare say. Alright, some leather pantalones. Ooh, some much needed potions. I mean, we haven't been using them, mind you, that much, but... It's like there's uh, stuff to be looted over here. And, of course, uh, as we all know, I must level up. Uh, two to strength, one to constitution, one to dexterity, one to speed. Uh, I don't know when I'm going to get an int in wisdom, or if I will at all, but I, I think I say it every time, but still. I always feel like I should get something in that, maybe bring it up to ten at least, but eh. All right. Well, I do like that we got another potion. That's not very good. Let's see, maybe it's good. 27 armor class pants. 31, 22, 22 versus 15. Yep, gotta switch those. Got stuff and fifteen. These are strength based and they're not quite as good as what we've got. Alright. That's fine. It happens. Okay. I guess we look onward. New magic ring. Ooh, maybe a new uh, cape for our uh, mage lady. Let's see. Oh, yeah, with the combat energy. It's always going to be one of those things, right? I don't feel like the combat energy is that critically important, but I know it's pretty important. Might hold on to this. And the uh, only person with a ring missing is you. That's one that we can easily replace down the line, so... Take it. Uh, so far, the battle's been very straightforward, which I actually appreciate a lot. But I'm expecting an ambush. This feels like a good ambush point. Well, there's a rickety bridge. Oh. Well, we got some big boys, some orcs in there. And an orc archer. Do we really have anywhere we can hide? Can we even hide here? A little bit. Well. Let's dance. It is just the tricor of them. Okay, well, I won't cast a spell then. They can come over the, the hill if they want. This could actually work out okay. Did, did the poison not work? Are you kidding me? Alright. Oh, that didn't hit the other guy? Uh all the mistakes all at once all right haunting 
Oh no, the poison did hit him. Okay, Ooh. good. Excellent. Oh wow. Okay. I uh, did not expect that. Just kill no, it doesn't just kill him. That's fair. Alright, let's go ahead and throw the heal. Take care of this guy. Start rolling toward our boy here. You wanna play, my friend? We gonna to play. He's gonna have a real bad uh, time here in a second. I'm really close to you, brother. Alright. How much we could have done there, other than what we did. Pretty much worked out perfectly. I think this might be the end of the cave. Oh! When attacking converts 5% of melee damage to health. Well, I think we just found our replacement ring that we were just talking about. Uh, almost assuredly, that's what we're talking about here. Anything else seems to be a little bit better than the resistances, but maybe the resistances are amazing. I don't know. Either way, that's a pretty sweet ring, I must admit. Go ahead and do another quick save. These are not like... Oh, wait, there's more stuff in there. I thought we were just going to be able to run to the end here. I can't tell what all is in there. At least two... To the bad guys, to the uh, little cobalt dudes. Oh, there's so many of them. Uh oh. Okay. That was something that we were concerned about. <laughs> For a while, and it looks like it's finally going to happen. Pretty sizable hit there. And we leached uh, some health out of him. What are they doing? Oh, they have a shaman in there somewhere. Okay, that might be a little bit scary. All right, uh, these guys, I am pretty sure we can just defeat them. Are you guys close enough to be hit by this? No? Are you guys close enough to be hit by this? I hit one of them again. Ugh. Alright, mistakes were made, I guess. bad things are going right now, but I think I'm just going to shoot the arrow because I don't think... Oh, no, I could have hit him. All right. No, oh, I should probably taunt right now. Try the fireball again. That had to. Does it not always explode? I don't. I don't understand. Like you would think that it would like always explode. Oh, just outside of range. 
Okay, he dodged. It's okay. I feel like if I do this, I'm going to hit everybody. I'm going to try it, though. Still only hitting one person. That's just baffling. Me. I've wasted so much mana not accomplishing my goals. Dead. Yep. He's pretty close to dead. Should have a pretty good shot here at hurting them both. Quite enough. It looks like the shaman are coming, but they're a little bit behind. do this. Yeah. Felt like the better play. Can't hit him. Are they gonna throw stuff at me? Oh. Oh, I hate that. Let's uh, try to put a stop to that immediately. Oh, we don't have enough mana. Alright, that's cool. Like a lot less overall. Well, hopefully, whatever spells come flying our way, we'll be able to. Oh, they're throwing heals. We'll be able to counterbalance with heals of our own. Alright. Big hit. Getting a little bit closer. That should kill him? Yeah. Go ahead, hit us with it. Okay, I get to hit you with my own little magic arcane bolt of love. Alright, it's not of love. It's, there's definitely some menace and malice behind it, but you know. There we are, look at that. Ah, uh, the ambush, not quite successful, but that's okay. The barbute. The El plated boots with uh, some spell power or damage or whatever. Armor class. All right. Whew. Could have definitely have gone worse. All right, we got one. Is that all we needed? Was the one? All right, let's take a look at our side quest. I feel like this is kind of important. Godfrey told us that a special cave found in an... Sorry, of a special crystal found in a cave underneath the village could be used to power up the teleports. He wants such a crystal so he can safely visit his family in Misirida. But while we are there, we could just as well get one for ourselves, making traveling a lot less time-consuming. We got the crystal. Now we must return to Gadfrey in the North Village to collect a reward. A eternal reward. All right, something about a maze. Walking dead. And then we'll also get our fast travel on, too. Cool. All right, let's get out of here. I'm, I'm a little disappointed there wasn't, like, some, like, cool treasure loot. That kind of freaked me out a little bit with the glow in there. Um, some cool treasure loot at the end, other than the crystal. But the crystal is a very big part, right? Being able to teleport around from town to town seems important. So, yeah. I think that's pretty important. So, I'm happy to get it.
Ah, now we have to wander our way back up to town, and then teleportation will be ours. Or so it seems. Cool. Well, like I said, I'm very, very happy that we found, like, where to go and what to do. Uh, makes it a lot more enjoyable when you don't just die to every fight because you're not supposed to fight it yet. So I'm pretty happy. With how everything worked out for us here. Uh, all right. So sorry, you were this guy over here, I believe. You. Uh, really looking forward to seeing my family again. Here we got the crystal. That's so amazing. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now I can finally see my family again, and here, as promised, your reward. Your eternal reward. No, God. Yes, heroes. Thanks to you. Uh-huh. And remember, whenever you want to use a teleport, just hold the crystal in your hand and walk onto the teleport. Cool. Gonna go do that now. I just kind of want to try it out. I don't think I actually have to have it in my hand. Oh, I know. Okay, cool. So, Great Wall, North Village, East, and West Village. Sweet. I mean, I don't... Well, you know what? I think I do need to go to the East East Village. Because that's the one that gave me the quest to unlock the teleports, I think. So I need to go there to get the credit for doing the thing and stuff. Oh, my God. Well, hello there. Are you the teleport guy? Uh, no. Uh, wait, was the teleport thing part of our main quest, or? No, all right, hold on, hold on, side quest, fast travel. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Somebody gave us a, a, a thing, gosh darn it. Hmm. Well, we're here. Let's do this. Let's have a look. Go to cell mode. I mean, I'm pretty sure. I mean, some of the stuff might not be. We'll sell this first row. And then we'll close the trade window. We'll see an eye. I think I'm going to sell that. That's fine. No, that's not going to work. 27 is better than the 24. You can only go up to 20. It's fine. 17 gloves. Better than 16 gloves. All right. Oh, you don't have the dexterity required. Well, that's fair. And then you have 10 armor class, 5 spell damage. This is a 6 armor class, 5 spell damage. So, no. Not a worthy contender or upgrade for you. Sorry. Okay. Uh, is that good? Sell mode. We're going to sell all that. All right, cool. Man, I, I really thought this is where we got the uh, fast travel um, upgrade. Like, really? Maybe it was the West Village. I mean, I don't think so, but maybe. I mean, I thought we got it, like, right away, as soon as, like, we started talking to people. No, I haven't found the flower yet. Though I, I could probably do that, maybe, at this point. No, I know how to handle a shield.
And what do you teach us? Any kind of melee weapon. Oh, well, I mean, that's, that's lovely. Hmm. You were the shield? Yeah, sorry. And you... you tell us something interesting? Oh, uh, I need some training. Yeah, it's... Okay, I, I think we, we pretty much did everything that we need to do here. You're the negotiator. You had that other quest to kill everything in the crypts, which is uh, maybe getting closer to being within our abilities. But I still feel like it's too far out. Connecting. I, maybe this just never gets finished. I was like, we have the crystal now. All right. Well, whatever. I like I said, I tried. Uh, we'll go to North Village, and then I guess we backtrack to the temple. That feels like the play. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I suppose we'll find out. All right. Well, that leads elsewhere. And then we go down under the uh, the temple. Hey, you know what? We got quite a bit stronger through all of our uh, trials and tribulations and all the stuff that we did. So I'm pretty happy with that. Down and around and here. I don't, I don't know that this is the right play, but it might be. Anyway, we will, uh, we'll figure it out in, I suppose, the very next episode, folks. That's going to do it for now. Until then, I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thanks so much for stopping by the Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer.